So all the numbers are the same across two boxes. Uh, we have the same type of clues in each of the boxes, but one of them is all correct and the other one is all wrong. Yes. I mean, it's possible for you to have everything be all correct and me to have everything be all wrong, but I don't think that would happen. I don't think that'd be it either, no. Yeah. All right. Well, let's get ready, going. Ready, set, go. All right. Okay. So... I mean, is it fair to just assume the things are correct just for now until proven otherwise? If, well, if my box six is correct, I have a digit. If, if your box six is correct, you mean? If my box six is correct, I have a digit. The um, box six cell one would be a nine if I'm correct. Box six cell one is a nine? If I'm correct. If yeah. you're correct. I mean, nine does work with my grid still. It works in your grid the same? Oh, I mean, yeah, it, it, oh, wouldn't it, matter. it wouldn't matter if, you're, if okay. yours is correct, then mine would have to be wrong, right? So, <sighs> Okay. Yeah. I, no, no, no. If it will be... So, it's the king in box six. Yeah. I'm guessing that's killer clues for you? Yes. I think we have the same clues in the same box. Or the same type of clues in the same box. If mine is correct, box six cell one would be a nine, mm -hmm. and it would also be a nine in yours, but your killer clues cannot add up to the correct Exactly. Goal. Yeah, that's what my, I'm saying. Mine, mine, mine would have to, and yours would have to not. Yeah. But they would still be the same digits in the same places. So if I'm correct... My brain hurts already, by the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um... We need to find out. We need a. We need a, some way to definitively say somebody has to be. Have to have some. Right. But that nine, that I said doesn't, like instantly break. It can still work with yours. It's not like a nine and a two cage or a three cage or something. Huh? It doesn't instantly break, and it doesn't matter if it instantly breaks something either, because it's supposed to break my clues. Yeah, I don't. I honestly don't know how the heck we're supposed to use these clues because we don't know if they're right or wrong in the first place, right? Right. So, I mean, I guess we will just share yep. notations until something just doesn't work, and then we'll have to work backwards and figure out whether we trust it or not. I guess. Okay. All right. Um, where is your? Do you have a V clue in your box five? Yes. Where is it? Um. So one and so four. What is your? Okay, my V is in three and six. So I'm just gonna label all those as one, two, three, four. And that's my one, two, three, four quad in box five, even though one of them's okay. not correct. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Um my box uh, Well no actually Yeah, my brain's breaking because it's just so difficult. I have no it's idea. It's not a one, two, three, it's cannot be a one, two, three, four quadruple. Yeah, it cannot be a one, two, three. Oh, I guess I don't know, whatever, we'll figure because... it out. If one of us is correct, it'll make a one four. You know what? Pair. I'm gonna yeah, highlight. Like I'm gonna highlight three. my clues. Actually, I'm gonna highlight your clues in green. And my clues in I don't know blue for now. Your clues in blue. Yeah, that way I can differentiate where the, where the pencil marks are coming from. Um, I have in uh, box two cell five. I have a six seven eight nine due to arrow being three length okay not touching any part of my arrows in there um what's box three dutch whispers Did you yeah at least four? dutch whispers is odd For the incorrect version, this means that only one of the pairs of digits in one specific line has to have a difference of a three or less, but more across Um, them. All clues in the box must be incorrect. So, uh, yeah, I wonder about Dutch Whispers, but right? Does, say it mean, Dutch... does it mean, like, none of the things can be more than four apart? Or does it just mean just one thing needs to break the line and it's good enough? Only one part of the line needs to break. 
It says, for the incorrect version, this means that only one of the pairs of digits on the line okay. has to have a difference of three or less. Okay. Same for the Rin band then. So two number, or I'm, I have a three length Rin band. So two of the numbers could be consecutive, but the last one can't be. Correct. They could be a one, two, four. <sighs> it should break the Rin band. I have a like four a... length, um, what do you call it? Sequence long. Is that helpful? Same. Same. What are the things that can go in there? Uh, I guess it's just the same as a four length Ren band, but you also have additional options of like two, four, six, two, four, eight, six, eight, one, or... three, five, nine, one, four. No, it can't do threes. So they're going to one, skip three, one five, or skip seven. twos. Right. Yeah, they're going to increment by one or two. But no. I have actually my entire box one is um is white crop keyed. So everything's connected to each other. Everything. Yeah. Well and mine not, are... not not all connected to each other, but they're connected to at least something. So I have got three dominoes and then one triple in uh box one. And three black crop keys. So if I'm if I'm the correct side of that, oh, if you're the correct side of it, real quick. where where would where does five exist? Actually, where would if I'm the correct side of it, five would be in the top row. Your your things uh, would mean five, seven, and nine. They would all be in the top row. They'd all be in the top row. Mm-hmm. Which would break my white crop key, but that's intended. I think it might be box one the breaking because that would make the most sense. Yeah, think... box one might be where we need to go because I think that one's pretty for sounds pretty forcing. Um, what would your other ones need to be? You need to have a three six. I need a one two, a four eight, and a three six correct. And it can't be any other, right? Because they all in the same box. Okay, you you know what? You might need to tell me how your black crop keys are allocated. Um, I think I think I'd have an idea. If you're one two, if there's if if all of your black all dots, conversation about constraint types, placements, and digits is allowed. If your if your black dots drop. all overlap with my white dots, then one two is impossible because that means my one two would be correct. Does that make sense? Right. So so I have a black dot between cells four and seven. Yes. A black dot between five and six. Yes. And then and it's, uh, eight and nine. So eight and nine. Okay, then your black dots have to be wrong because uh, there's no way that. Yeah, because if they're right, I'd have a one two and a make your your right one two well. will make my one two correct. Okay, yeah. so I color that whole box red for me. Okay, I now these have to be wrong. So this can but yours are have to be right. Yeah, so all of mine now have... have to be right. <laughs> so that means also then none of these can be one two. Oops, I went to my pen tool. I don't know why. Don't ask. Um, I... Okay. So none right. of these can be one two, but. So where is your one two? Uh, okay, that means none of these can have one. So one must be in the top row. Okay. And it must be so one must be in box one or sorry in cell one or cell three. That's and then two, okay. two must be in cell two then. It has and to be two. Has to be right because one goes into two. I, I have white crop keys. Okay. And okay. then and then the other one has to be a three. So it's a one three, two, and then another one three. I see. Yeah, I can picture it. Yeah, and one, then two, the three, rest of three, these are going to be like four, five, four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine. Yeah, that it has to be. Okay. Yeah. Um, that puts one, two, three in top row, which means yes, it does affect my box too. Which means my arrows are impossible in box two. The arrows are now impossible. Impossible because this mine has to be right. We have three more digits. If let me let me think, because the the minimum of this is four five, and that's already nine. So my triple length arrow cannot produce any number. So yeah, all of my arrows must be wrong. Yeah, I'm deleting box five at this point. So yeah, just going. So mine are correct. 
We have a four or five pair. Sells two and oh cool. Just there's a meteor shower going on. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna use the pen tool. I'm gonna use a circle and an X in the middle of my thing. Show what's Oh, what's, what's correct and when it when's yeah. correct. Okay. I think that's if I have a four or five pair for you. Oh, okay. Hit me. Box two sells two and three. Or four or five. Oh, two, two and three. Yep, and box or sell six is a nine. That's the only way that arrow can work now with the one, two, three triple looking at it. Right, right. And then what else? This this could be a few things. Or it can't be one, two, three, four, five. So this one at least. So I six. so that nine, I have an arrow in box two on uh seven and eight. That cannot add those so that domino cannot add up to nine. Does that make sense? Sorry, which ones? So in box two, seven, and eight, those two cannot add up to nine. Okay. I don't know if that helps. I just want to let you know. There's a few other combinations left. There's three, three more possibilities for my other arrow, but these two cannot add up to nine. Okay. I do have a six, seven, eight triple, I believe. Okay. Um, no, wait, why did I write six, seven, eight here? I don't trust that. No, I don't, I don't remember why I wrote. No, that was if you were correct, it would have been that. Okay, okay. but you're very incorrect. So definitely, I do, don't have any triples there. So okay. I don't remember if. But we have one, two, three, four, and five on the top row. That might break box three a little bit. Yeah, uh, nine has to be in the top row in box three, right? Right. Um, and box three is Dutch Whispers. Ooh, actually, it might break my... Let me just take a look at this for a second here. Because these are all highs. Right? So these are all highs. Makes this one really tricky to get to. How do I how do I flip a Dutch whisper? Uh, I guess I can go not five one, but then this one. I don't think I don't think mine works. You don't think yours works? Yeah. Okay. So I'll, I'll tell you what I have. So. They're all highs, right? On the top there. Six, seven, eight, nine, yeah. Yeah. Um so two of the highs are connected with one gap, and then one of the other highs is connected by oh, a two wait, gap. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Adjacent digits any I don't know why I'm so slow with this. Mine cannot be true at all. Yours is wrong? Mine has to be wrong. In box three? All highs. Yes. If they're all highs. Yours is very constrained then if yours is right. But okay. no, these yeah, these two cannot be four apart. Okay. Because they're both on the top row and they're both high. Okay. So oh, then mine has, has to be, be correct. Wow, that's then this is yeah, I I thought mine I, was I thought my lines of source for it didn't matter, but it did. But how how it do sounded like you had a very long line in there. Oh, I see. Then this one has to be nine. This five and then one and then these will work. Okay. I was I was going it the wrong way. Uh, so box three, cell three should be nine, and then underneath that is a five, and then in the middle is one, and then I don't know what the other two are, but they're now both possible. Okay, so this one is always going to be broken, no matter what. So I'm good there. This one. Oh, hold on. I have a uh, box two cell four is now a two, which makes the box two cell one a six, and box two cell eight an eight. Sorry, box two cell one is a six. Okay, and cell eight is an eight. Okay. Uh, that means the one 
uh, so box two has cell to nine has to be nine. one. Yes, I remember that. Like that can't add up to nine, and that's here's a one. They get, on. and then the remaining cells are three and seven. We don't, I don't know those yet. And then this cell oh, has to be here. at okay. least three, only three away from this one. Um, box one, is... sorry, box one cell seven is a nine, and then above that is an eight. And then, um, box one, uh, eight, nine is a four, five pair, and then above that is a six, seven pair. Oh, sorry, no, the three, seven in the box two. Three's uh, in the center of box two. Okay. Right, because the six seven pair looks at the what is the seven. last one? And it'll be a four. Yeah. Sorry, the last one in right. row two is a four. Uh, row two cell seven. Sorry, I uh, and yeah. Yes. <laughs> and I changed, box I changed the coordinate cells, system on you. Box two cell seven to seven, right? Box two cell seven to seven. Yes, I just put that in. And then box. Three cell one has to be a seven. Okay. And then the so other one's top... an eight. Yes. And then we have a two, three, six left in the row. Um, which would have to mean the three is in cell nine. The other two is a two six domino. Got it. Hey, we're we're not doing too bad. No, I'm not. Jinx does than I. No, it's just you had to find a way to start. Yeah. Turned out doing the boxes in order been working so far. So I'm going to look at box four next. I'm looking at um, box five, actually, because some of the yeah, clues are pretty the... restrained. Box five and also even box um, eight. Some of my quads got restrained as well. Wait, I don't think my box five is true. Oh yeah. This will have to be a one four because of the two. And I need a two eight and three seven. And this one can't be either. Yeah, my box five is false. Sure. Let me just go through this one more time. If it's true, we start here. And it has to be one four on the V because there's a two looking at it. So it has to be one four and that makes, I need two tens and I have the one and four already claimed. So I need a two eight and three seven and this can't be two eight or three seven. So yeah, I'm false. I'm hey, box five. So far, so far my stuff is uh, almost all true. Okay. Um, that means, so box five, cell three and six is a two, three pair. Okay. This probably restricts a lot. Okay, then, um, what's it called? So box five sells eight and nine is a four six pair. Eight and nine is yeah. four six. And okay. sells uh, four and five is a one nine pair. Which, if my quads are correct, solve, but I don't know if my quads are correct. And. So that would force a seven. Self. Seven has to be in cell two. Oh, yeah. that makes a two in cell three. Uh, two in cell three. Okay. Yes. To so make sure mine are false. Right, right. And then we have, and then the three is Eight done. And five. Yes. Oh, not that way. Let me see. Uh, I mean, my quads have to be false. Minor, the rest of my box has to be broken no matter what, so I think I'm done. So are you looking at which box now? I was just looking at my quads in uh, box 8, but they seem to be not broken yet, so they seem to be possible still. Ooh, mine would be... 
forced here. Mine is still possible, yeah. Actually, either way, you know where the sevens are, twos, threes. This lines up suspicious for it. It looks, it wants to be true, but if it isn't, I have a force number. No, wait. I don't know. Okay, I was like, if. So, so for box eight, if it's false, it can have some of the numbers in the circle, but not all of them, right? Yeah. Okay. So you can have one of them, but the other one you can't have. Right, if they're two, two numbers in them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, my only has two numbers. Okay, box four. Because this isn't affected yet. Box six is, doesn't. Box four is sequence lines. So this jumps up by ones or twos. Do you know any? And they are its direction, so it has to be from one end to the other. Okay. Oh, there are thermometers in box seven. Okay. Yeah. It looks different on my screen than normal thermometers. <laughs> Is this possible still? Six will have to be. Two, three would have. To be. Four would have. To be. Two would have. To be. Two would have to be. Before, and this is an. My box six has five known digits, if I'm correct, if I'm true. My box six is very forced. You're sorry? My box six is very forced, if okay. I'm true. Mine is starting to look that way as well. Four fives. Oh, actually, mine does not work, so yours must be true. Your, your killer clues don't work? Yeah, because it puts a 7. I have no place for a 7. Why well, 5 digits for you. Are you ready? Let's go. Um, so on box 6, so 1 is a 9. Uh-huh. So 5 is a 5. So 6 is a 7. So 8 is a 3. And so 9 is a 1. Okay. And then so 4 and 7 is a 2-8 pair. Okay, the 8 will go in 4. 8 on top of the 2? Yeah. All right. And then the last cell, cells 2 and 3, is a 4, 6 pair? Uh, the 4 is in cell 3. 64. All right. So that's great. Yeah. Uh, and that resolves box 3. Yes. Oops. Got to color mine green because it worked. I just put a big fat. All right, X and on. now we have a lot of numbers for. For Renban? Yes. Oh no, not Renban. Oh, I guess Renban, but box four. Oh, okay, sure. Uh, yeah, let's look at box two, four, four and two, four and six. In row five. Oh, it hurts my brain. I don't know. Sequence hurts my Wait. brain. 
two, okay, two, four, six. Mine is false. Mine has to be false. Oh, okay. Thank God I don't have to think about this. Oh, I do still have to <laughs> think about it. Because um... <laughs> mine... If you're watching this back later, mine is two, four, six, and there can't be an eight. Ah. Uh. And it can't go six four two. It will be a zero. Oh, since there's two. Okay, so mine has a two four six on the sequence line, which means the last one has to be an eight, right? Right. Uh, so that puts right. an eight in four three. So three. Yeah. Mine have to be in cell. Do one they have to be I in don't... order as well? They do. They do. Oh, so then that puts the six underneath the eight, the four in the middle, and then the two on the left. That's really forcing. That resolves a bunch of stuff in box one, but the yes. five eight in box five. Okay, this is a one three pair in column one. And the last digits one, two, four, five, seven, nine. That's a, a two by two by two, right? Five seven nine in row six cells one two three. Yeah. Okay, I think it is. Okay, I know the order too, since I have to be incorrect. Okay. So it can't be nine seven five. So cell nine is the five, and then the rest should be done with box one. So in that in order. It's seven, then nine, then five. Okay. All right. I only had two true ones so far. Doesn't mean I'm winning. I've been lying on mine. <laughs> I've been wrong in boxing on mine. <laughs> wrong in boxing. I can still come back and get the win if I get all three of these true. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it would be okay. like the setter to do that, too, hey? Mm-hmm. Let's see. This could be a two, seven. six, eight. So, if my thermals are correct, then these cannot be 1, 3. Rim bands, non repeating consecutive to be 987. My thermos are okay. How's your thermos? I'm looking at run bands, I didn't oh, okay. touch the third nose yet. Okay, that's so if my run band So it's correct. one three cannot be yeah, my thermos are very flexible. Five, six, seven. About it. Yeah, mine mine seems oh wait, this can't be this thing's up. No, I still have enough. I still have one possible thing. But let's see. Okay, if, if my box thing. eight is correct, I have a seven eight pair. So my box eight. Um, box eight cells six and nine. Is seven eight pair if I'm correct? Six and nine. Seven eight pair? If I'm correct, there's seven eight pair. But how can it be a seven eight pair? We have a seven and an eight. Oh, sorry, nine. Six eight. and nine. Yeah, six and nine. And if I'm incorrect. Wait, but don't we have. Actually, a... no. Um. Cell 6 is always a 7 or an 8, if I'm correct or incorrect. Whether you're correct or incorrect? Okay, interesting. 
It doesn't no, wait, make wait, a difference wait. online, though. No, it could be... No, never mind, that's not true. I have a very... It's very forcing if I'm correct or incorrect. Mm -hmm. On the sevens and eights. You want to take a look at your thermos? Because my thermos were... Almost breaking, but then they were open. I mean, one, my thermos seem fine. Okay. Darn. <laughs> um, uh, wait. Um, one of them would need a one to start with the one, and the other one would have to end with a nine. I have very two short thermos that are pretty flexible. I see. Yeah, mine, I basically have a 7 8 pair at the tips of two thermos. Which, yeah. Okay. okay. So. Wait, what are these? Digits. Four, five, six. Yeah. Uh, does any of your thermos overlap with mine? Wait, no. I'm trying to think if there's anything like that crop key logic earlier. Where you can't both be correct. You know what I mean? Right. Well, yes, that's... Um, just looking at my Ren band, this... Even on the right side, both of these would have to be odd. My Ren Ban is forced if I'm correct. Yeah, my Ren Ban is forced as well. I have a 7, 8, 9 Ren Ban. I have a 5, 6, 7. Um, so it would, and then I have a 4 in the center. Um, a four in the center, an eight in box or box nine cell six, uh -huh. and then a seven and nine on top of the four and beneath the four. Maybe seven and pair. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't break. Need to do you. anything. It's not on mic though. I mean, it's kind of hard. I, I keep trying to compare like horizontally, but then like. Hmm. Have you have you exhausted all your other clues around everywhere else and the the top six stuff? The one three pair in box one that's not unsolvable. Four five pair in box two that's oh it forces a four over here. Let me see. Um a four or five pair in box two that doesn't resolve. Box three is done. Box four has a one three pair that doesn't mm -hmm. matter to me. And these, I, they add up to, they cannot add up to 10 no matter what I try. These cannot add up to five whatever I try. So right, box well, I'll five is done. And box six is done. So we have to figure out what's like fresh logic, I think. Yeah. My thermos, they're just both two two cell thermos. So I have two two cell long thermos. So this just has to be smaller than that. And it does mean that one of these has to be a one. Because if they if none of them are a one. I would start with the three, and then it both need nine, basically, because it can't okay. get anything else. I have an idea. I'm going to tell you a couple of my dominoes. Okay. Um, and if any of your stuff makes these dominoes true, then it means that uh, my stuff will be true and your stuff will be true, which means uh, your stuff has to be wrong. It's similar to the crop key stuff in the beginning. Does that make sense? Right. 
Yeah. Okay. Uh, so box seven mm -hmm. uh, sells two and five. I have a seven eight domino. Um, if if either one of those ones is a seven or eight for you, uh, that means there's no way to yours escape. yours are broken. Oh yeah. No. No. I was. Okay, so I have a seven eight domino and two and five. If you can put a seven or eight it, with your logic on any of, uh, in either two or five, if either one of those ends up being a two, a seven or eight, then um, my my thermos will. It's impossible for my thermos to not be correct. Does that make sense? I mean, column two forces a seven or eight into box seven and the eight in the box seven for those cells. Oh, you're right. So they have to be a seven and an eight. So at so, least one so of mine, those So mine has to be true. Or mine has to be true then. Yours has to be true? Yeah, because there's no way to escape it. Okay. Does that make sense? I'm not exactly, okay, so, but so the it tips... has to be a seven and an eight. Okay, I'll, I'll, just tell, I'll just describe the thermals to you so you can, you can double check my logic. Um, I, I just have two short ones. I have a thermos going from uh, four to two. And then I have thermos going from seven to five. So the the seven eights are on the tips, right? And then we have right. four, five, six in column one. So they so will always one's... be lower. Right. Yeah. So there's impossible for them to not be for for one of them to not be correct. So that you, either this one's a seven or an eight, which makes that one correct, or this one's a seven or eight, which makes that one correct. Yes, yeah, and since one of them is correct, they both must be and correct. And so since the seven and eight have to be in that column, S, you can f hide one of the sevens that it's away, but you can't hide both of them away. Yeah, exactly. So, so yeah. So yours is true. Yeah, I'm so mine's false. true. Once again, so I'm false. I win, so right? You win, yes. yeah. <laughs> so mine, this has to be higher than that. So I have a nine. A nine is in uh, cell nine of box seven. Okay. Box seven, cell nine is a nine. Okay. Um, so yeah, obviously, uh, cell eight is a one or a three. So eight is a one or a three. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I eliminated the four here, but I, I should oh, do that. It has to be a three. Okay. It has to be a three. Which is which resolves a bunch big. of stuff above it. Yeah. And it's a one two pair and a seven eight pair. Now my thermos are always broken no matter what I do. Okay, perfect. Okay. Cool. Um, let's see what else we can do. That cannot be three. If I'm correct, the box is. If my box nine is correct, it's getting very forced. Um, yeah, I should take a look at this actually. Because this would make this and this. Mm -hmm. so that would always be bigger than that. It's bigger than that. Yeah. It's just so these ones. If I'm correct. The one would have to be over here. Five feet anywhere. Oh no, five can't be in anywhere. This this should have to be seven and eight. So. If my box eight is the correct one, it puts a seven eight pair in cell six and nine. Okay. Does that? No. So my my work with yours or I so for mine I need a one two pair in uh in uh five and eight, and I have a three nine pair in um 
one and four. Uh, and unlike the thermos, I need both of them correct. So. Yeah, so you need a seven, eight in six and nine. Six. Yep. Okay, mm -hmm. so as long as I don't have a seven. Oh, wait. Eight. Oh, did I write this backwards? I think I did. I'm actually kind of getting close to putting a seven, eight, so. Well, it would mean, so if, if a seven, eight is in six and nine, right? Mm -hmm. then it just doesn't work because it would it would make your quads correct if a seven and eight is in those cells it would make my that quad correct yeah and i will say i can't have both box eight and nine be correct i have to have at least one of them wrong oh really because if for all, if both of them are correct, that would be an eight. That would be a seven and eight, and that would be a seven and eight. And I break my row. Yeah. So I have at least one more wrong box. So I can finish off everything. Uh, no, I can't. Cannot. So one so of mine, one of mine has to be wrong as well, because. Um, mine can't be both correct because I have nowhere to put a four in column two and column five. In column five, you lose the four. The four has to oh, wait, be no, wait, in column works. four. There has to be a four in column four because of the four X wings. Yeah, actually, no. Wait, mine mine does work. I think mine resolves completely. With if the, if the, if both of mine uh, box eight and nine are correct, then mine just finishes. Yeah, my nine is correct. It finishes a bunch of it, but um, if my yeah, if my nine is correct, my eight is incorrect. And that forces that to be the seven eight. Maybe we just need to compare quads. <laughs> I mean. So my other quad is um, a one five circle for those two, three, five, and six. Two, three, five, six is a what? One five. One five. Oh, no, one... that doesn't work then, because I would put a one five in there. You would also put a one five in there? Yeah, for my solution. And where's your other one? A seven, eight, and... Four, five, eight, and nine. Four, Beneath. five. Wait, four, five? Yes, four. Uh, no, five, six, eight, and nine. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, if I try to avoid your seven, eight, that would put a. F that would make your one, five work. Okay, so. So that means I'm mine has to be wrong, there. right? Oh, I am true then, because you have to be wrong. Because if uh, if mine is oh no wait mine could be right, but then my ren then would have to be wrong. In order to not force these numbers. So okay, wait. I I might need to rewind here. At least so, I know this is not correct. So I'm sorry. In box eight, if I put a one five in my quad there. Yours it also work? Sorry? If I put a 1-5 in my quad, on my grid, would your grid also work? No. So, okay, I'll tell you what my quads are. Um, my quad is a on 1, 2, 4, 5. Is, that's a 3-9. Okay. And then my 5, 6, uh, 8, 9 is a 1-2. Okay. So the one might be the problem, right? That's the only overlapping number. And um, in my quad, in my grid, uh, the one is forced into, into row 
five. It should be forced in yours as well, right? Depending on the Ren band. No, no. So, okay, in column five, the one has to be in box eight. No, it could still be in box five, cell five. No, because of your your quad. If my quad's true, it has to be in column five, correct? Yeah, and if my quad is true, it has to be in column five as well. So either way, it has to be in column five. Okay. So, so, that, so that resolves is... nine and one in box five. Okay. All right, so the one in box eight. Then I, and we have a three nine. The three and nines are solved. We have a three and nine pair in cells one and four, no matter what. No matter what? Because I, I put the four in box seven, but that's only because of my quads. Is that forced just, on you? Just doing Sudoku, column four is six, two, seven, five, one, eight, three, nine, a three, nine pair. And then the last digit has to be four so that's true for you too right because i i already have a four in uh box eight cell seven but that's only because of my quad logic right i just got that now you just got that now through sudoku yeah i don't see it no because i don't no i had a, you oh. resolved <laughs> okay, the one okay, okay, in box I, five so i could finish off that Okay, so then four. then my quads have to be true. Then your quads have to be true because of the 3-9? Yeah, the 3-9. So mine are false? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I totally, I was like, okay, there's the 3-9 over here. I, I totally didn't even see that. Uh, oh my gosh. So, there is a 7 or an 8 in cell 3 of box 8. Sorry? Box 8 cell 3 has to be a 7 or an 8 to make sure mine are untrue. Okay. So that puts a 7 8 uh, pair in row 7. Right. Which could disambiguate this. And then a 1. A one can go anywhere here as long as the five doesn't join it up here. Yeah, if my Renban is correct, then box nine is all fully solved. So my Renban. Is a seven eight nine? So we have there's a one two pair in row eight as well. Do you have that? I do not. Okay, uh, I have a one two pair in box eight. It is um, cell five and cell eight. That's a one two pair. Hey, cell JC. five and cell eight is a one two pair. Yeah. Okay, now I do. Okay. So what's the rest of your box eight? Um, I have a five, have a three, six, nine. five, six in cell two, and then the other ones is a five, six, or seven, eight. Okay. All right. No worries, JC. We have the Glad one to have you there. That doesn't break my rim, man. It's we're so we're actually possible. making really good progress on this, honestly. I got scared when I saw that the other guys took like two hours on this, was it? A really long time. Yes. Yeah. We're at 48 minutes. Which yeah. Doesn't feel like it. Yeah. And, and making we, regular I, progress, no like hard stops like the other one. Yeah. I feel like we're we almost done. So, yeah, my, so, so my rim band, I think, would solve the puzzle if it's correct and everything works. So, unless I, unless it makes yours work. Okay. Um, what is your rim band again? Um, if I'm correct, my Ren band would start at cell two, mm -hmm. and there'll be a nine there, and then it goes to an eight in cell six, and then a seven in cell eight. So okay. a little arrow. So I, I also nine. have a seven 
in cell 8 and an 8 in cell 6 with my solution. So I guess that's, oh, that's... always the case. Um, mm -hmm. but, I, but then I have a 4 in cell 2. But 7 and 8 will, are guaranteed then, yeah? And then I have a 4 in cell 5. Okay, so... but so I, my Renban is a 6 in cell 9 and a 5 in cell 4. Oh, eight, seven, six, five. No, mine is just a five, five, six, seven. No, just five. I don't. I don't need the eight. In mine. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Um. So if your solution is true, you cannot put a five in cell four and a six in cell nine at, at, together at the same time. So mine works. Five, mine works please. in breaking yours, but yours. I don't know if you. But we have. Do we have the seven and eight? No matter what. Yes. Well, my if my solution is true, then the seven and eight will go there no matter what. The seven is in cell eight, and the eight is in cell six. Yeah, and that that actually puts a bunch of gets rid of a bunch of stuff. Yeah, it gets the seven, eight, seven. Oh no! It has to be the eight. Oh, and then, okay, I have a 2 and a 1 now. Um, box 8, cell 5 has to be a 2. Box. And then box, yeah, box 8, cell 5 is a 2. Okay. And box 8, cell 1, or box 8, cell 8 is a 1. Okay, then my Renban is broken. Yours is broken? Yeah. Because the 1 has nowhere to go. By Sweet Prince. Okay, so mine is correct, and I have everything but a 2 6 paradigm in box 9. Oh, yep, I got it. It's done. I am almost there too. I had to make some assumptions about your stuff. Wait, oh, I still haven't filled in the. Yeah, I didn't explain box um, nine for you. <laughs> You're just a sore loser because <laughs> most of my boxes were correct. Yes. Oh, that was that was pretty fun. It was box nine though. It's one nine six three four eight five seven two. Uh, yeah, I just remember that you said the 9 had to be in cell 2, and then I yeah. just went from there. Yeah, and then a 4 in the center. I didn't remember that, but the Sudoku gave <laughs> it to me. Yes. Yeah. That was cool. That was that was pretty fun. Uh, uh, felt so daunting, but then it wasn't. Yeah, it was at least pretty... it didn't take us two hours to get a digit, so, you know, there's that.